are we being watched? With the recent string of murders, it has us wondering, are we being watched? Have you ever noticed cameras in certain areas of St. Louis City, usually on light poles near the intersection? Well, it's true, we are being watched. All of the surveillance footage goes to a real-time crime center located right inside of the police headquarters off of Olive. The purpose of the real-time crime center is to, number one, improve or increase the safety of St. Louis Metropolitan Police Officers. According to the St. Louis Police Department website, RTCC helps with mobile license plate recognition and investigator support to first responders as well as detectives handling follow-ups. Millions of dollars being allocated to this program, but is it working? With the heightened fear of an alleged serial killer, the community needs reassurance. We must emphasize alleged because it hasn't been confirmed by authorities, but it has been heavily speculated. Even with all the shootings happening along Highway 70, MoDOT has access to over 300 cameras along the interstate and highways in St. Louis City and County. If need be, couldn't detect a subpoena footage regarding all of the shootings on the highway? Within minutes apart on Highway 70, two people were injured, one fatal and one critical condition, in different locations. Although there has been a drastic decrease in crime, how many murders are being solved? Not to play the blame game, but as citizens, we deserve transparency. When it comes to our safety, are these cameras worth it? Are we really being watched or disregarded? These are the type of uncomfortable conversations we need to have.